So hello everyone, my name is Ablon and welcome to another video. You know, playing with the mobiles, getting, you know, popular every day. The hardware on phones are growing fast and you can play GTA V on your mobile. So we are going to count down top 10 best mobile games for ongoing entertainment. These mobile games will help you in 2024 to enjoy your times. Just before we dive to the video, I really appreciate it if you like the video and subscribe to the channel and maybe don't just watch the video and enjoy your time maybe i can help you i appreciated that let's dive to the video number 10 before your eyes before your eyes is a 2021 adventure game developed by good Bad world games and published by skybound game the player controls the recently deceased benjamin Bryan on his way to the afterlife the player must interact with Brian's memories through eye tracking technology to progress through the game. The player's eye movement and the blinking is registered by the game as a blinking is the player's main way to interacting with the game, including moving time forward and indeterminate amount of time in Brian's life. This narrative structure was inspired by the 1949 stage play Death of the Salesman, which portrays the story party through the protagonist's memory. The player can instead opt to play with the mouse instead of a webcam as clicking will perform the same actions as blinking. Number 9 Genshin Impact Genshin Impact, like Pokemon Go years prior, took the world by storm when it came out for free. This was in the midst of lockdown too. So like Animal Crossing, it was a lifeline to those in need of gaming comfort. It's a gacha game, which means the gameplay loop revolves around in-game currency being spent to receive a random in-game item. With new items coming out all the time, it might seem a little daunting to start now. But many people do, and there are plenty who swear it's never too late to begin Genshin. Number 8. Favorite Souls Wayward Souls is a fantasy adventure game that somewhat resembles the old top-down Zelda series, with the gameplay loop more aching to a roguelike. The challenge of this game is a step up from all we've mentioned so far, but we thought it was time to include something that tests your abilities. If you are a fan of Hades, or even the Souls series, and fancy something similar on your phone, we recommend the Wayward Souls. Number 7. Super Mario Run Sometimes we just want a familiar face when we're out and about with only our phone for company. Well, rest assured, because everyone's favorite Italian plumber, unless you're acquainted with a real Italian plumber, is available on mobile. And while it might look like a generic runner, the game is super fun. It isn't an endless runner, but an automatic runner with plenty of different stages, each with plenty of coins to collect. There are loads of different mods too, and a toad garden to build and expand with the coins you earn. Happiness in the palm of your hand. Number 6. Among Us. On birthday cakes. In memes. In a crowd at a fancy dress party, the Among Us guy is a cultural icon, and we think this is well deserved. Another game that blew up in lockdown, Among Us, is a sci-fi Cluedo in which friends must work together to keep a spaceship afloat, while one of three murderous imposters try to sabotage the whole enterprise. It's still enjoyed by many today as a quick social game to jump into whenever. Very simple but truly one of the best mobile games out there. Number 5. Thimbleweed Park on the surface, blend of the X-Files, Twin Peaks and 80s retro gaming means once you've dived in, you won't be disappointed. And it's no surprise, because this point-and-click adventure comes from the same team that made the iconic The Secret of the Monkey Island. Winner of multiple awards, this title will be a blessing to your mobile. Don't just take our vault for it, try for yourself. Number 4. Slade Spire Heralded as one of the deck builder roguelikes, Slade the Spire almost needs no introduction. In Slade the Spire, players seek to make it up further in many floors of the procedurally generated spire that features many enemies and a boss 
at the end of each level. Simple to play, difficult to master, would some of the slay the inspired best, and its addictive and rewarding gameplay will make any journey pass by in a breeze. Number 3, <laughs> yeah, Stardew Valley, come on. Another casual one here, but it's so adorable we just have to give it a higher spot. In this role playing sim, players take control of the character who inherits a farm, how they continue with the open ended story after that is up to them. If you want you can live a quiet life of solitude or you could get married and have children just look at the screenshots though it is lovely looking game and if you give it a chance we think you'll have a lovely time number two papers please one of the best video games of all time was released on mobile earlier this year so we had no choice but to whack it at the top of this list Papers, Please is the border control officer scene which is absolutely nowhere near as dull as, this, as that sound. Your decisions have consequences, both for the innocent or not people you're letting into a fictional dystopia of Arstoska and for your own family at home. It's a moral dilemma game and dare we say it, a piece of art. You need this game and if you haven't already played it, download it on your phone. But before we dive to the last one, I really hope that this video will help you to find some best mobile games to you know actually enjoy your time on the travel or actually on the <laughs> on the work. Like it and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Let's dive to the last one. And number one, Sky. Children of the Light. In a sky, players explore one's prosperous kingdom using a cape that allows them to fly. The in-game world consists on seven unique realms, each with a variety of areas to explore and a theme representing different stages of life. There is also home, a small island which serves as the world hub and the starting point for the player. Throughout the world, players encounter spirits that allow them to unlock items in return for in-game currency and children of light that give players wing light. When a player has collected enough wing light, their cape level goes up, allowing them to fly farther. 